I wonder if that dynamic will change this fight because neither guy really had the right amount of time to warm up. For what it's worth, Revchenko had a little more time than Solomon because it was Solomon who was and not and dealt with enough. second. Point well taken. But again, both guys were disturbed yeah. from their normal routines. I believe underneath there somewhere, there should be some kind of... No, no, actually, there is no place. But the right knee has had surgery more than once. It's been a problem. He's 42 years old. And you wonder if it's going to hold up. One thing Solomon brings, experience, experience, and more experience, explanation or example of that experience difference. Solomon has been 12 rounds 23 times. <laughs> well, Dever Benchenko has never been past eight rounds. It's not the physical abilities, it's the experience, the awkwardness. Coming in. There's a right hand from Solomon, and then chases back against the ropes as he was off balance, and he goes down. A right hand score by Derevchenko. Knockdown score in round number one. Five, six, seven, eight. You know, okay, Sam? Yeah, walk to me, baby. There's uh, opportunities to catch Solomon coming. You know that old saying, Joe? That's no, no, what you can see for Derevchenko. Yanchenko right here, and it will work. You can catch Solomon coming when he leaves those gaps, and you can catch him going when he goes straight back. Veteran Sam ah. Solomon, knockdown scored in round number one. When you mentioned the right knee being an issue, of course, he fought for the middleweight championship in 2014 against Jermaine Taylor, gave way of the belt. In that fight, he injured his right knee badly. He was able to finish the fight, but was off balance throughout and was down plenty, and then was trying to come back and fight on March 5th against Antoine Douglas, but re-injured his right knee in training. Had to have arthroscopic surgery, so. He's always on point when he throws punches, never out of position. Even when you walk with a guy like Solomon, you haven't seen him out of position. His legs are always there, and he's accurate with his Break. punches. Don't punch. If Solomon's knee was okay, he said yes, it was completely fine. He just caught, caught, and in the end, they weren't fine at all. Got to have that steady foundation. You know, Devorinchenko is no spring chicken at the age of 30, Joe. But, you know, fighting somebody 42, I mean, he's the problem of youth tonight. On that very talented Ukraine team, this is being Two. scored a knockdown. So that's the Four. second knockdown Five. scored. Six, seven, eight. It's just not Sorry, a pretty picture at times when you watch I Sam will. Solomon. And our opening, when I said it, the Derek Vincenco wants to go into the neighborhood of the other Ukrainian right fighters. there, score knockout against a guy who's only been stopped once in 58 fights. His glove almost touched the canvas yeah, right there. Right. Now he gets him in that neutral corner. See if he can thud home. Oh, my! How about that left? Sam Solomon crashing down. Sensation there. Two minutes, 41 seconds of the second round for your winner by technical knockout, Sergey the Technician, Derevyanchenko.